This is Raccoon on his own, Discussion Questions, Part 2. Hi everyone, it's Miss Smith. I miss you and hope you're doing well. Before you answer these questions, see if you can remember what happened in the story, Raccoon on his own. Then you can watch it again. First, think about and talk with your family about how did the baby raccoon feel as he drifted downstream. How do you know how he felt and how did his family feel? Then you can talk about how did the raccoon's reflection keep him company while he was in the boat. This question is a little bit tricky because you have to think about Max from the story we read when we were in school. You can re-listen to that story in the description below. How is the baby raccoon similar or different from Max in that story? 